Hello everybody, this is my first video as Vamp Games, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to make t-shirts on Roblox without Builders Club. So first thing you do is you go to roblox.com, go to roblox.com in a new window, or a new tab, whatever. So I'm going to go to Roblox. Obviously you will need an account for this, so sign up if you don't have an account, and log in if you do, obviously. So you want to go to the, three, the third tab from the logo, so that would be develop. Then you would want to scroll down until you see t-shirts. Mind that you can't make shirts and pants because you're not Builders Club and Builders Club can do pretty much everything else. So as you can see I already made a couple shirts. To make the shirt you want to go to canva.com. I use this for YouTube thumbnails and many other things. So when you're there, you want to go on the top right where it says use custom dimensions. And for width and height, you want to type in 128 pixels. Make sure it doesn't say anything other than pixels. So after that, you want to click design and you'll see this loading screen and it'll automatically go to an untitled design. So when you're here, you wanna go down to uploads and most likely, if you never used Canva before, then you will not have any uploads here, but I have quite a bit of uploads here. So I'm gonna do a green background and I'm gonna do another YouTube logo the rare emerald so um, now I want a green gradient background so I would look up green gradient background so when you find the background you like you want to click on it and once it loads you want to hold down left click on it drag it to the bottom right corner if you have Windows if you don't just drag it to your desktop if you have Mac pretty much any operating system will allow you to drag that into your desktop so when you're done with that, you want to go back to Canva, and you want to click Upload Your Own Images. This little box will pop up, and you want to go to Desktop or whichever file you dragged your picture into. So you want to scroll down and wait until you see your picture, or you have to scroll up, depending on where you put the file.
and there you go you have your logo but if you want to add more detail just keep uploading and dragging pictures in there and I will how to download and put this onto your Roblox character so you want to click download once it's done loading drag it to your desktop go back to your develop page click choose file click on whichever folder you downloaded the picture in and scroll down or up until you see it so now I see the rare emerald.png so you want to double click on this and it'll pop up as the file name you can change this to whatever name you want I'm going to name this to So now you want to click upload, and there you have it. And if you really want proof that I'm not Builders Club, and I do not have Builders Club, as you can see. So now you can close out of this, and you, you now you can delete whichever pictures you dragged onto your desktop before. And you can drag your t-shirt design into any folder you want, or you can just delete it as it's already on Roblox. You can close out of the Canva page and your t-shirt is successfully created. So go to adv avatar and go to t-shirts and go to wear. Keep in mind this may take a little while to load as it's probably not even moderated yet and obviously it's a more detailed shirt so it's gonna take a long time to load. Also keep in mind that if you have a detailed shirt like this and you log into games, it's going to take much longer for your character to load in game. This is proof that you can wear this. So make sure you click wear also on the shirt that is loading or it probably won't load. Um, I know from experience, but if you like this video and if you found this video helpful remember to leave a like and if you didn't find this helpful still leave a like and subscribe and i will see you later goodbye